quindi? Quindi l'esperimento è andato molto bene, siamo molto soddisfatti, sì. è stata messa appunto una tecnica di visualizzazione che funziona molto bene su questo tipo di tessuto specifico. L'hai provata, hai ritrovato, la diamo. su vari tessuti diversi, eh. molto diversi, e, e il risultato è oggi sulla visualizzazione. Questo ci fa trasparire. Ok, so, uh, I'm here at the, te at the Tissue Regional Bank of Emilia Romagna uh, with uh, the two brains behind this uh, last foraging experiment. Uh, we have uh, Dr. Elena Bondioli, which is the head of this department, and I have a precious assistant, Dr. Valeria Pontura. And uh, I want to ask them uh, a few questions so you guys understand where we are. Okay, uh, first of all, I want to ask Dr. Essa Bondioli uh, which is the percentage of decelularization in the uh, The matrix is uh, scalp for cell free, uh, it's DMA free, and so, the cell free. So it's self-free, the yes. matrix is self-free. Se totally. Totally self-free. Self yes. So which is uh, yes. You know, a, good, a good, <laughs> good result. Very good result. Okay. Um, the matrix is uh, perfect because I use one technique uh, is uh, soft for the to treat the tissue. To treat this tissue. Yes. Okay, so uh, very soft. Very soft. Um, so not really strong chemicals? No, not, uh, not use uh, chemicals. Okay, perfect. Thank you. Thank you. So, the next question I will ask Dottoressa Purpura. Uh, how much do uh, you think, uh, uh, well, she already answered this question, she said the matrix is perfect, so at this point we want to know uh, all the foreign support, we want to know which is the next, the next law? What's, what's the next step? Um, yes, the next step uh, will be uh, the in vivo uh, experimentation on animal model uh, in order to evaluate the biocompatibility uh, of our matrix, the forest skin, uh, with the animal tissue. And this step is required uh, for the future clinical application. So this is the, the next step of the foraging experimentation. Okay. So we have a good hopes that the experiment will continue very well. Absolutely, yes. And then we will go on you know, human model. Oh, yeah. So after the animal. After the animal experimentation that is required for uh, so the clinical demonstration. That, uh, um, uh, that adverse reaction are not uh, uh, present in the animal, and that there is a biocompatibility of our tissue, of our matrix with the uh, with the animal tissue. Okay, so thank you, thank you very much. So, thank you. Thank you, thank you Ellen. <laughs> Fantastic. Thank you for for it. Thank you. Thank you for it. You are wonderful, both of you. <laughs> and, uh, bye bye for the conference. Bye bye. Thank you.